it's easy to be a good investor today. And I'll tell you why. Normative moral issues are starting to infect very large pools of capital. You know, so you have these public pension funds that are not allowed to invest in all sorts of stuff that creates a sin premium in those sectors. But then now you have conservatives fighting against ESG, forbidding like Florida from investing in ESG stuff. Soon, soon, public pools of capital. Oh, then there's China. China's now evil. So we can't invest in China anymore. But five years ago, they were buddies, whatever. What I'm trying to say is like, there is so much morality and normative issues that are seeping into finance that those investors that don't have those mandates are going to be able to harvest sin premium uh, off of stocks and off of investments. I mean, like tobacco stocks are great stocks, right? Because nobody wants to hold them. The dividends are high. Similarly, there's going to be this sin premium now in everything, in China, in oil, in ESG, weirdly, you know, as conservatives don't invest in ESG, as like liberals don't invest in oil. At the end of the day, like the reason that we have fiduciary duties and responsibilities, and it's supposed to be the only thing you care about is because it works, <laughs> you know? And, and I think that uh, morality and normative issues in investing is, is very tricky. It is very, very tricky. And it's going to create a lot of dislocation and informational opportunities for those who are nimble and who approach investing in a nihilist uh, manner.